So now, here, pigs are omnivores. In the wild, they are foraging animals, primarily eating leaves, roots, fruits, and flowers, in addition to some insects, fish and dead carcasses. Frogs are obligate carnivores meaning that they cannot survive without meat in their diet. Adult frogs eat insects, small mammals, small amphibians, small fish, small birds and occasionally small vertebrates. Bears are omnivores that have relatively unspecialized digestive systems similar to those of carnivores. The primary difference is that bears have an elongated digestive tract, an adaptation that allows bears more efficient digestion of vegetation than other carnivores. They eat berries, roots, fungi, grasses, fish, carrion, small mammals, and insects. Rabbits are herbivores, their diets include grasses, clover and some cruciferous plants, such as broccoli and Brussels sprouts. They are opportunistic feeders and also eat fruits, seeds, roots, buds, and tree bark. They rely on a strict plant-based diet. This is because they need a lot of fiber in their diet. Spiders are carnivores eating insects such as flies, moths, cockroaches, fleas, mosquitoes and even other spiders. Some species, such as the tarantula and the goliath bird eater, are large enough to eat small rodents, amphibians, lizards, snakes and small birds. Sheep are herbivores as they typically eat seeds, grass and plants. Human beings, as we know it, are omnivores. People eat products of plants, such as vegetables and fruits. We eat animals, cooked as meat or used for products like milk or eggs. We eat fungi such as mushrooms. Deer are herbivores as they eat young shoots, berries, twigs, grass, leaves, bark and other plant matter. Lions are carnivores as they usually hunt and eat medium-sized to large hoofed animals like wildebeests, zebras, and antelopes. They occasionally also prey on larger animals, especially sick or injured ones, and eat found meat such as carrion. Thanks for watching this video and don't forget to subscribe and like.